everybody. We are here for A's game day at the Powerade Center. I'm Megan McPeak, your play-by-play -play voice of the Brampton A's. 7 p.m. tip-off. If you're not already on your way down here, make sure you get down here. We are yet again taking on the Ottawa Skyhawks. We've played them. Tonight will be the fifth game in just as many weeks. We played them on Wednesday on the road in Ottawa at the Canadian Tire Center. Unfortunately, your A's dropped the game 111-97. They shot 39% from the field, 35% from long distance, and 70% from the foul line. The A's have proven that they can beat the Skyhawks. However, they've gone away from what works for them, their run and gun style of play. The advantage the A's have though, is the fact that bigs like Cabell Johnson, Kevin Francis, and Flynn Whitfield can all run the floor and can outrun the bigs of the Skyhawks. Your possible starters for tonight's game, Melvin Council, Kevin Francis, Cedric Moody, Flynn Whitfield, and Evalda Zabez running the point for your Brampton A's. On the other side of things for Ottawa, Ryan Anderson, who is second in the league at three-point shooting, making 49 on the season, sitting at three per game. Terrell Baines, Jermaine Johnson, Justin Tubbs, and Jerese Crouch. Your head-to-head -head matchup, and it's a little bit different than normal. I'm going with Cedric Moody and Ryan Anderson. Neither of these two, two players will guard each other throughout the game. Cedric Moody being a guard for your A's, and Ryan Anderson a forward for the Ottawa Skyhawks. The reason I like this matchup, like I said, Ryan Anderson is second in the league in three points made, total and per game. Cedric Moody is one behind him at 45, sitting in third place, and two per game. I like that matchup because it is exciting, it's a three-point shootout, and it's definitely going to play into the part of tonight's game. For the A's to win against the Ottawa Skyhawks, on my side of things, they need to get the ball inside. Points in the paint are going to be key. If the A's can get it down low or get guard penetration, it's going to be a completely different game. It's very simple. If you can get in the paint, you can get to the hoop, you might get the foul called, and it's an easy trip to the foul line. The only thing is, the A's have to start converting on their free throws. Yes, they can shoot at a high level at 7% in the previous game, but we've seen them shoot over 80% from the foul line as well. Hope to see you tonight. If you can't get down here, you can catch it at BramptonAs.ca.